this one looks real. Why do you think that one looks real? Well, because it has the same designs on my shoes that I have on. And, the, and it looks it looks more it looks more authentic than this one here. This looks neater, more well put together than this one. Oh, well, you got it. You're right. That's <laughs> that's the real one and that's the fake one. Okay. No. No. And the reason I don't is because to me that's stealing. That's that's taken away from the name brand. And that's and I know we all have to make a living and market stuff, but to me that's stealing from the name brand. And like that's pirating, I think. We own a pharmacy in Dallas, in, in Arlington. And I'm a caregiver as well. I deal with medications seven days out of the week. So I'm very particular about the medicine. If they change the color, I'm always calling the pharmacy to find out because the lady that I take care of, she's 82 years old, I cannot afford to give her any fake medicine. 20, 30 billion dollars. What if I told you it's 250 billion in physical goods and then when you add in the piracy of movies and CDs it goes up to 650 billion worldwide? That's unheard of. It is unheard of. Wow. Just think what we could do with that money.